Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the sister tag with my little sister. Her name is Melanie and we are 10 years apart. She's obviously really special and since she's my only sibling, I mean, I'm stuck with her. So the first question is, describe each other in one word. You're very serious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll take that. Describing somebody in one word is so unrealistic. I can think of so many words, but you're not just one word. This isn't even a word to describe somebody, but she is a teenager. Within the last year, you changed so much. Really? Yeah, but I don't know. It's like she's my baby, and then now she's a teenager, and it's sad. Second question is, do people ever get you mixed up? Oh my god, yes. <laughs> No, they don't. Yeah, they do. They're yeah. always like, oh, look, there's Jeanette. Oh, wait, no, Melanie. Or, uh. Third question. What is something that annoys you about one another? One thing that annoys me is she'll start laughing at the dumbest things <laughs> ever. And then she'll show me what she's laughing about, and I'm like, really? That's not even funny. Really? That you wake up, like, super duper late. I hate it. It just... Oh, it's just like I wake up at like 7 in the morning and she like wakes up like at 11. I'm like, what is it like being sister with a YouTube guru? Okay, that question's kind of lame because this is just my hobby so it doesn't, it's no big deal I feel like. Well, it kind of gets annoying sometimes because she's just like, oh, let's go take pictures sometime and I'm like, oh, I'm so lazy. I just don't want to go. But you're my little helper. I know. <laughs> all, all, all you pictures that you see on Instagram, I take those. I'm training her well. <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever argue? Hardly. Not really. I mean, I think it's because we're so far apart that it doesn't really matter. Like, and, mm. and even if we do argue, it's like really, dumb. Really dumb. <laughs> like over... Like, I'll ask her to give me a piece of her food and she'll just be stingy and not want to give me any and then I get mad at her for that. <laughs> but that's basically it. Like, it's no big deal. What's the best thing about one another? Well, she's my bigger sister and I get to, like, follow her steps. Like, she did everything first, so I kind of get a copy off of her. <laughs> Aw, that's sweet. That means I'm a good role model. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think it's cool to have my little sister because I was an only child for 10 years. So even though I had so many cousins to grow up with, it's nice to have a sister that you know that's going to be there forever and ever. <laughs> Favorite inside joke? One, two, three. Olive, Olive juice. juice. Favorite, Favorite memory, memory together? <laughs> Yes, that's been the best memory ever. Okay, so this, was it this sum last summer? Or? It was this summer. This last summer? Yeah. Okay. Um, we would go, well, when we went to Mexico for our vacation last summer, we went to this little store and we just got a buttload of candy. Because Mexican candy is the best. It's so good. And we would just sit there and eat all the candy that we could. And yeah, and then... That's all we ate. We yeah. didn't even want to eat anything else that day. That's literally all we ate. And we never do that. Like, I'm not a big sweets person, and she really isn't either. So, just because we were in Mexico, we're like, oh my god, we're not going to be here in like another year or two. We were just like, let's just get just everything, and let's eat it, because we're not going to eat it in a while. And for some reason, it doesn't taste the same when you eat it here, because I know you can still get a hold of it at certain stores. But when you're just there and you're like in Mexico with your family and like, I don't know, it's just different. That was pretty cool. I know we are 10 years apart, but we are full sisters, meaning that we have the same mom and dad. I don't know why my parents waited so long and kept me an only child for 10 years, but I'm so grateful that I have a little sister now. Guess each other's <laughs> favorite singer. Okay, okay, I'm gonna try to do this because she loves music. Taylor Swift. No. Dumb! Not, you love Taylor Swift for like Taylor. the longest time ever. Not somebody else. Katy Perry. No. Um. Do I know her? I think you do. Is she on the radio? Give up. Yeah, go. It's Christina Perry. What the heck? I showed you her. <laughs> I know. 
<laughs> That's funny. I honestly don't have a favorite singer. I have listened to so many things that... Who takes longer to get ready? We all know this. Uh, duh, it's you. Pants or dresses? I would wear dresses. I love dresses. Yes, me too. High five. I would wear dresses too. I love dresses. I'm so excited for summer and spring to wear dresses all the time. Favorite animal? What's your favorite animal? My favorite animal is a... A bunny. How cute. What's yours? A white tiger. Ever since I was a little, little, little kid, I always thought they looked so pretty. If your house was burning down and your entire family was sure to be okay, what would you save and why? It has to be something that you can easily carry. Not like your bed that you have to push it out and stuff. I can have a stuffed animal like after all the shock and stuff, you can just hug it. <laughs> <laughs> save your makeup. Save, I have this whole drawer of just like important papers and I think if there was a fire I would just grab that drawer and run out because I've heard horror stories about getting all of that replaced. Comedy, horror, or chick flick? I think comedy. I would have to go with comedy too. I think we should change that question to Android or iPhone. Um, I have an Android phone and I'm Android all the way. I would have to pick an Android too because iPhones are just so overrated. Like I like my Android. I feel like if I would go to an iPhone, I would miss my my Android phone. Favorite movie? I have a favorite movie. Is Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind. My it's favorite tangled, movie, huh? Big Hero 6, so far. That movie was pretty cool. And I'm a sucker for animated movies. What is something weird that you eat? I know everybody eats this, but she always eats bananas with peanut butter. Combining peanut butter with a banana? Ugh. Sometimes in the morning, she like looks up these things for like her diet and stuff, and she finds this green pancake one day. <laughs> <laughs> and, and she makes like this green pancake, and I come home, and I just see a green pancake, and I'm just like, where's the green eggs and ham? Do you guys have anything matching? Like exactly matching? I don't think so. We have similar clothes. Like last weekend, I have a picture. Maybe <laughs> I'll put it right here or something. Where we were wearing like the same color dress. I mean, we have a lot of like stuff that's the same color, but... No, we're not those kinds of sisters that we wear like the same clothing. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite TV show? You know this one. Yes, I do. <laughs> Once Upon a Time is like her all-time favorite show. She went hounding me, I would say for months, trying to get me to watch it. There's a character in there named Bay. It's pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. Your favorite show, Game of Thrones? Well, I think I have two. Is it one of those? Yeah, it's that one and... The Walking Dead? Yes. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I love zombies! Oh. And I always think about a zombie apocalypse and if I were to survive or like, I've had dreams, like full on crazy, like cinematic dreams in my head where like when I wake up, I'm like, oh my God, I should write it down because this would be an awesome movie. Like, then we're trusting her on it. She has I the do. whole plan. There's an attic in our house. So I have a plan where like we would literally just go up to the attic and then our whole house has like a, like a wall around it. It's not that high, but we have a gate in the front where we could probably just like barricade so it doesn't open and I, I have a feeling that would hold us up for a bit before we have to like scavenge for food. Or there's a Costco literally like really close to my house. We can just like go over there and we'd survive for a couple months I think. Run to water. This is the end of our video. I hope you guys enjoyed meeting my little sister Melanie. And if you guys want to see her in more of my videos, I am more than happy to show her in more of my videos. We can find fun videos for us to do. And all my social media is down below, Just Fashion 101 I have Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Snapchat to keep up with me. It's pretty fun. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to get all the latest videos. Alright guys, see you in my next video. Toodles! Toodles.